Okay, we are here at the park. It's at, I forgot the name of this park. I'm parked, okay? My car's parked. I'm at a park. Um, I have a lot of different um, pork rinds here. I actually have some pork crackling strips with some of the puffy pork rinds, and I have some Mexican pork rinds. They're lime and chili, so they have to be Mexican. I, I just say that because the people that make these believe that if you put lime and everything, it makes it Mexican. Hey, what are you okay. doing over there, sir? Do what? What you got going, what you got going on here? Oh, I'm just doing a, um, a review. Yeah, I'm doing a pork. I do. I have a YouTube channel, The Garbage Disposal. How are you doing? You're a ninja disguise. Um, What's up? A ninja disguise? My ninja. What's up with oh, that? Oh, my shirt. Yes, it says, ask about my ninja disguise. I can barely read if it's right side up, okay? Okay, well, ask me. You're a ninja disguise. What's up? A oh, ninja disguise. I am glad you asked. Oh, oh, cut, cut, cut. <laughs> it's not even that funny, guy. Okay. Oh, I'm glad you asked. Okay. Well, all right. I got to get back to work. Oh. Okay. Well, I'll let you get back to what you're doing. I got, I got other stuff to do. I got a thing. Uh, thanks for stopping in and thanks for asking me about my disguise. Check this out. This video will about, be out in about a week or so. Uh, just go to thegarbagepostal.com, hit subscribe, hit notify. Please share with everybody. Okay. All right. Thanks. All right. Let me get back to this. Okay, guys. Uh, let me take a quick break. Uh, Get, get myself situated here. Got all riled up when I put my ninja suit on. <laughs> oh, and I know about your channel. I got your shirt on. Smart guy, very smart. Okay. I am back, guys. Sorry about that. Uh, some people see me at the park, and they just want to uh, see what's going on. Um, I have all these here. I'll take a picture real quick with my phone of all the different kinds I have, and then uh, we can get started on it. <clears throat> Excuse me. Uh, I don't know if you like pork rinds or not. I would have Tasha help me out with this one, but she doesn't eat pork. And I'm, I'm pretty sure pork is in pork rinds. I'm not the, the brightest street light in the neighborhood. Never been accused of that. So, uh, but the light's still on, okay? This light of mine, I'm gonna let it shine. Let it shine, let it shine, let it shine. Okay. You have the fat back pork crackling strips. Two nineteen. I don't know what the real price was. I think that's just a suggested retail. Uh, fried pork strips seasoned. Sweet and mild barbecue pork rinds. These are the fluffier kind. That's what she said. Brams barbecue pork rinds. We have the original, looks like no flavor at all pork rinds. That's why they're that cheap. They, they, they cut the flavor out of there, so they cut the price. Oh, we have the lime and chili. Oh, that's going to save for last. And we have the hot, hot brims pork rinds. Oh, look at that. The hot is $1.49. Okay, hot is cheap. <clears throat> Excuse me. And no people, I don't have a mask on. I'm in the park by myself. Well, that other weird guy. Okay, let's go. 
with the first one you saw. I'm just gonna go down the, the line. So I guess I'll do the hot ones last. I'll do the, 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 the Mexican ones uh, next to last because I, I did that in a row. Man. If this was an ASMR and I have to try to make that louder, that would be crazy loud. This is just regular. One more. Uh, these? Fried out pork fat with attached skin. I'm not a fan of these. They're okay if you want something to do, but for something to do for 22% sodium of your daily fiber, it's not, it's not a good thing. So this whole bag would be over 150% of your daily, daily fi uh, sodium. You don't, you don't turn them up. Your daily sodium. So this whole, this little bag is 150% of what you need for the whole day. So a day and a half worth of sodium in that one bag. This one's the same. Six servings, 22%. I don't know who six people would be eating. Well, six people might eat on these because you're gonna run out of teeth so you have to pass it to the next guy. These here look a lot better. They look like they're breaded. Gotta get them apart. I don't know if you can see these. <laughs> they do have season on them because it made me cough. I try to hold that in. That's what she said. These are about the right amount of crunch that I want. That's not too hard to break your teeth. And uh, they're, seasoned, they're seasoned really good. Really good. I mean, there's not just barely on there. They're on there. I don't know if they sound as loud as the first ones, but they're not as hard. Just believe me, folks. Believe me. Okay. Brought some water out here. Just uh, this is my acid water. I paint black on top if it's my acid water. Actually, <clears throat> actually, I paint this black so Tasha doesn't touch it because it's acid water. No, because it's tap water from the house. She doesn't prefer that. She will drink it if she has to, but uh, I put it. I, I just refill this one bottle so I don't have to keep on drinking water from the store, okay, that they put in the garden hose and fill up the bottle and say it's spring water. It just sprung up in the bottle, that's what it is, sprung up water from the hose. So I just fill it up, and, and but when I do the Earthling versus me and the, the new ones, you know, like the new bottles, when I'm trying to do a race with somebody, I do a brand new bottle. So but this is just, I don't, I, don't, I don't really too particular about it. But if you saw this video, this video just came out. Uh, the vlog 210 of when um, I got this package in the mail and uh, Tasha opened it to see what it was. So you'll see her reaction if you watch that vlog. You'll see my reaction to the package that she bought me, supposedly. Oh, wow. Hmm. Oh, do you know the difference, guys? This sweet mild is really good. If, if you didn't have any of these and you like barbecue and you like a little bit of sweet, it's not too much, this is freaking awesome, guys. This bag here, freaking awesome. Look, there you go. <clears throat> these are really good. Um, it's 11% sodium, okay? So this whole bag is four servings, so it's 44%. So. Just half your day, day with the sodium. Uh, but this, I found out why these are $1.49, because these are the puffier kind. The ones that are hard like that, the uh, cracklings, they are actually, uh, the cracklings are two nineteen. the pork rinds are $1.49.
Mm. And a good thing about me, I can buy these. If I wanted to buy these sweet and mild barbecue, I can have them laying around forever because I should don't eat pork. So I won't have to worry about waking up in the middle of the night and somebody ate them. Okay, these are the pork rind barbecue without the sweet and mild. They look like they look like the sweet and mild barbecue, but they're not. If you just don't like a hint of sweet, then you'll like these, but after having those, these are nothing. Like this is barely barbecue, but No. It's okay. I'm eating another one. Mm. Nothing to brag about. <clears throat> okay, here's the original barbecue. These are gonna look they look like they're healthy. They're still eleven percent sodium. How is eleven percent sodium? Oh, just a pig. Well, just not extra flavoring on it, so there's four servings in this bag still, so it's 44% like that one, and I would have the seasoning. I would think the seasoning would add sodium to it. This is a regular plain Jane. Yeah, you might have to add hot sauce or add something to that. Okay. Let's get Mexican with it. This, this commercial has been brought to you by Jose Espinoza. He does power washing in the Florida area. If you want to see him on, on Facebook, please inbox him at Jose Espinoza. He fishes, if you can't find him on, in, on Facebook, he fishes by the columns with light feathered, yellow feathers and light feather for bluegill. But here is the uh, lime chili. I like them. I like them. Okay. Well, I'm gonna go. I'll let you know at the end. I just wish these lime was in the pork rinds and not just the cracklings. Right. This is the red hot pork rinds. Red hot. They put the red hot in it so you can be scared. Devil dust. Hmm. It's not hot, hot at, like almost at all, but I like that flavoring. Eighteen percent sodium. They sprinkle it with red salt. Uh -huh. I'm gonna line them up. The ones I like. The most to the least. So this would be the best ones I like. Out of the pork rinds, okay? I mean, these are just out of the pork rinds. Okay, that's the favorite ones I like. I like the barbecue sweet and mild the best. I like the red hot. It's 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 just spicy after a while. You, you can taste the spice just barely. Uh, then the regular barbecue and the nothing on it. Plain Jane, naked, naked pork rinds. But uh, these right here, I wouldn't even put in the mix. I don't even want those. These right here are the best. Out of these, I'm going to say these are these are a close second. So these two here, 
these I wouldn't even pay attention to, but uh, these are close, neck and neck almost. But these have, I like the lime on this one. So uh, this one's, uh, oh, just mix them together. Let me just mix them together and see, and then I'll tell you. No, lime. I'm going lime number one. Use number two. Out of all of them together, these one, these one. Out of all of them. So, guys, I want to thank you very much. I really appreciate it. Uh, we have some people coming in here, so I know they probably want this pavilion here. So I'm going to wrap this up and hope you liked the video. Appreciate it. Uh, please share with everybody, your friends, family, even your boss. Please hit the like button if you like it. it. Takes me like an hour, maybe an hour to do a video like this, like half an hour to edit it. it takes you like about almost a half a second to hit the like button. Please hit the like button if you like it. If you don't like it, something's wrong with you. Just admit it. Okay, gotta go. GoPro, stop recording. Hey guys, I have hoodies in. The name brand are independent, so you know they are thick and high quality. I am have them all the way from small to 3X, uh, only in black right now, so just go ahead and look in descriptions for that. Uh, I do have uh, t-shirts as well. The name brand of the t-shirts are Canvas. Uh, they are thick, they are soft, the logo wipes off like a bib, just like on the hoodie. So if you want those, please check in descriptions. Uh, they all are pre-washed material, so they won't shrink on you. So check in descriptions for the price and the uh, shipping and handling of that, because I do ship in US and in Canada. If you haven't already, um, hit follow on The Garbage Disposal on Facebook and follow me there to get more pictures and stuff. Uh, please subscribe to my page. Hit the notification bell to get notified of upcoming videos. And hit the like button if you like it. Other than that, please share it with your friends, family, and even your boss. Have a great day, unless you made other plans. <laughs>